Right guys, this is the part two of the firmware update. So what happened after? Now, you can see uh, that this has come back as normal. Um, I have to press that basically home screen to get back onto it. Once this screen has come up, it does some up and down arrow and things like that. Anyway, so next thing I wanted to t straight away test, you know, what's going on uh, with YouTube or, you know, Android uh, Play Store. See if this, if this has fixed a bug that it was claiming uh, to fix. So I clicked on the Google Play Store then I went to existing. So because I have a Google account, I went to existing. Then I figured this, uh, I faced this issue issue here. You think, unfortunately, your uh, Google account manager has stopped. I was like, hang on, what's going on? I just updated the firmware. Has it got further issues? Then I realized, no, it doesn't. It What happened was I needed to go a step ahead and basically figure out a couple of things here. Uh, in fact, just the one thing, really. So I had to go up and basically um, fix an issue called um, the, the, the Wi-Fi connection, which is as simple, really. So I had to go and... Um, connect to Wi-Fi, which I've connected now automatically. So if I also, I didn't uh, eject the uh, USB flash drive from the back. So I can take that out safely. And the Wi-Fi is actually on at the top, you can see. Now, if I go on to Google Play Store, see what happens, right? If the Wi-Fi wasn't on, you would have to go back onto Wi-Fi and connect it. So if I go to existing, there you go, it works now. So previously it wasn't connected, now it's connected, it works. So if I go into email, there you go, the keyboard is on, it's working. Okay, so if you face this issue that Google, uh, you know, is not working, then it, all you have to do is um, go at the top right corner, click on the Wi-Fi, and make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi. If you're not connected, you're going to have to connect to your network again, because you don't forget, you did a fresh installation of the software. So you'll have to uh, connect it uh, to the Wi-Fi for this Google Play to work. Same thing happens, you know, you can't access really the online apps if the Wi-Fi is not connected. So I go into YouTube. Now, previously it did have an older version of YouTube. It asked me for an update. Now see what happens if I run the YouTube for the first time. There you go, welcome. It's working, I'll use uh, YouTube signed out. You can sign in with your account if you want, but I'm gonna use it without an account. There you go, it's a new version of YouTube, completely working fine. Perfect job done. Thanks very much for watching the second part of the video and I will let you go from here. Enjoy.